Hello everyone, welcome again to your soundscape. Today we are going to react to the song from Poland for the Uni Eurovision 2023. I feel very very happy because Poland holds a special place in my heart. I spent part of my life in this beautiful country as an Erasmus student, so I feel very attached to these people and to this country, this region, who has given me some very beautiful experiences that I remember for the rest of my life. We all know Poland is such a powerhouse in the Uni Eurovision Song Contest because they won twice in a row and they became second in the short period of four years. Wow, this is amazing, so we're going to see how they have done in these recent years. I can read Maja has won the national final from Poland and she has a nickname because she is Maja from the end of the world and it happens because she is from the last village in Poland before arriving to Kaliningrad which means Russia so she has that nickname okay that could be funny and she has already taken part in the voice kids in Cleo's team we all remember her she is the Eurovision representative from Poland in 2014 that became very famous because of that sassy performance with some other girls Okay, performing some interestingly uh, sassy, yeah And mm, she's 12 years old She's defined by her parents as a quiet, modest and somewhat shy girl But on stage she really brings out all her potential Okay, that's very good, so let's see how is her song for this junior edition of the song of the Eurovision Song Contest and I'm going to react to it. But first of all, we're going to listen to 10 seconds of it. Now let's see what Poland has to offer to we all in this junior Eurovision this year. I've looked for the national final performance because I could have checked that there is no video clip released yet. So, uh, yeah, we're going to see that TV program where she won the prize to go to Nice to celebrate the Junior Eurovision. Okay, well, I'm not ready. I'm not ready yet. Now, with this flag of Poland, yes, I do. Yes, I'm ready right now. So, let's go for it. It's going to start in 3, 2, 1. Go! Okay, Heroes Uni Eurovision. I can see her. Oh, she just need a friend. She has a beautiful voice. Oh, it looks like a ballad. I thought it would be more a beat. But no, not really. Okay, Payano Realness. Yes, this part is in Polish and I prefer Poland to sing in Polish because it's a very hard language but very beautiful. The melody is good. A lot of ooh. Wow, she's cute. Not bad, not bad. She's so nice. The song is growing. Let's see where it finally goes. But so far it's very slow rhythm with deep emotion that she needs a friend and now this part in Polish that I don't understand but I don't care because I like Polish language so much she's 
she looks like very mature performing in that stage. She has camera connection. In this performance we can see instrumentals come from an uh, orchestra and I suppose it's going to change for the Eurovision. We're going to have more professional or studio instruments instrumental and it's going to definitely change how the song sounds. This is growing and now it bursts. Yeah, kind of. It kind of bursts. Okay, deep voice. I like this young singer so much. Ah, oh, beautiful like butterflies. She's singing to all of us. Wow. Very professionally delivered voice. Okay, this is the song from Poland. Nice Poland, nice. You always do very great. After listening and reacting to this performance, I can think that Poland has two different versions of herself. First of all, we have a Poland who is trying to send to the Junior Revision very commercial and very radio formula songs and singers. And there is another Poland, sometimes in this contest, that sends maybe more young and less mm, mainstream singers and songs. And this is the second case. In the first case, we can check out that Poland has received a very high amount of points that, that lead them to the victory or to the second places and in the other cases in the other cases when they come with singers which are less mm, thought of being a product let me say it like that but don't mistake in my words that when they are not received more such a product i mean mm, they obtain a little bit low result in this case this is the second case because um, she is not very very mainstream sound in this song and I suppose it's not going to be that huge success in the radio formula that Vicky Gabor or Roxana Biegel obtained but I prefer this Poland I prefer this Poland because they are honest to themselves they are honest to the purpose of the Junior Eurovision, which is entertaining and having fun and celebrating diversity, as we always say, and not that uh, perspective of obtaining the victory in order to make money. It could be a little bit controversial, but this is the first thought that comes to my mind when thinking about Poland. Uh, of course, I enjoy so much Superhero or the other song that won the previous year that I don't remember right now, Anywhere I Want To Be, Anyone I Want To Be, something like that, yeah, which was very good, they were my favorites that year, but uh, yeah, maybe they could be um, skyrocket in other fields apart from the Uni Eurovision, so this year, 2023, I want to congratulate Poland because in my opinion they are sending a very good song. A very good ballad mixed with some more rhythm, which is nice, which could be attracting some votes. Uh, yeah, and I feel happy how they, you, Poland, are delivering this song. Mm, I don't care if it's going to be high or low, as I always say for the Junior Eurovision, because the purpose is not competing, the purpose is other. But um, I think it's going to be quite nice, yeah. So well done to this singer who is so talented. She's doing a very great um, performance in terms of voice, in terms of feeling. She connects very good with the camera. I've checked it out since the first time that she has a very mature and strong presence directing to we all her voice. And yeah, I have nothing wrong to say about this song. And special about that singer because yeah I think she's very professional at a very young age she's only 12 
and I can't understand how these kids are this talent. So well done, I hope everything goes amazingly good in the Junior Eurovision Grand Final. I hope they all have fun and I hope we have a very evening, very good evening all together. So let's see, let's see how it goes all this season until that day. I'm going to be reacting to some more songs. I'm going to try to do this for every song of the Junior Eurovision this year. So please stay tuned, keep on watching these videos so that you cannot forget, please subscribe, press the thumbs up button to this video and share, please share. So, okay, see you in my following videos and let's have a nice season all together. Bye.